The Consumer Affairs Department donates reusable water bottles for its consumer education program at the Ave Maria Girls Primary School to help tackle plastic pollution. Marvin St. Louis reports. Small, yet all significant steps in the right direction. In a year where international organizations are clamoring for action to tackle plastic pollution, the Consumer Affairs Department did just that. The highlight of the day? Consumer education. And it was fun. So today we are here um, to educate the young ones um, because the Consumer Affairs Department, which falls under the Ministry of Commerce, is responsible for educating consumers to assist them in making informed purchasing decisions. And we are here because we believe that we need to start with the young ones so that they can grow up and they can continue. It could be a part of them, their habits, their, their, their practices. And they too can also assist us as young ambassadors to share the word, to spread the word. The consumption and improper disposal of single-use plastics has become a global crisis. An estimated 8 million tons of plastic enters our oceans every year, damaging marine ecosystems. The Consumer Affairs Department is promoting the circular model of waste management, which includes reduce, reuse, and recycle. The student is happy to spread this message. I learned more about um, stopping pollution, spreading the word to others, and I learned reduce, reuse, and recycle three important words. The production and consumption of plastics has skyrocketed since the start of the COVID-19 pandemic. As the world battles this global crisis, the permanent secretary in the Ministry of Commerce is appealing to consumers to do all they can to save the environment. Remember the three R's. Reuse plastics, reduce the use, and also recycle. There is currently a replast project and we'd like to encourage you to collect your plastics and drop them off at um, the strategic points so that these can be exported and recycled. From the Ministry of Commerce, I'm Marvin St. Louis reporting.